We're involved in something that's been going on in the church for 2,000 years. And so there has to be a sense of destiny of uh, uh, understanding what was before us, and then there will come after us. But in this interim part, we, we build on the past, but we build for the future. We build on the solemn foundation of what is right in the past, not wrong, but what's right. And that's why one generation has the responsibility to give the next generation a solid foundation that whatever they build on will not be shaky, will not be off. Doctrine will be right. The heart will be right. So they can build on it, and whatever they build on it will stand through any kind of storm. And progressively, it gets stronger and stronger and stronger. We speed up. The momentum increases because the faithfulness of one generation feeds the next. From the very beginning, from the very start, your grace has been with me. From the very start, from the very start, your grace has been with me. It's all about your grace, it's all about your grace. up dreaming if you've got a God dream that's a God dream that's holy under the Lord what God has put in you he's put in you he hasn't put it in anybody else that's what I love he knows who you are and he knows what he's put in you the dreams that you carry are from God do not despise them do not despise them but honor them treasure them thank God for them keep speaking into them keep speaking over them and I understand when it doesn't go the way you want it to go just 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 give God praise Give God praise. You say, really? Give God praise. I, I promise you, every day in our world, yours will be the same. Every day I hear something that's disappointing. Every day I hear something that challenges my heart. Every day, every day, every day. Every day it continues to happen. But how many of you know that the disappointment has not held us back? It's like we face opposition, but we, are, we, come up, we rise above our opposition. We, we are confronted with reality. But how many of you know we rise above reality? We are confronted with what they say can't be done. It's on our doorstep every day. But we are not going to look at it and say, well, if you say it can't be done, I guess you're right. No, 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 no. If God has said it, that settles it. I'm going to put my trust in God. I'm going to put my hope in God. I'm going to live the dream.